Hi, I'm Sharon McGookin of Oasis Floral Products, and I have a tip to share with you today. A lot of times we get calls asking on Oasis Chat how to use a sphere to make a baby's breath arrangement atop an Eiffel Tower or a Lomi design system. So I wanted to share those tips with you. Beginning with our sphere, I like the netted spheres. They come in many sizes, as do the ones without the netting. But if you can't get a netted one, I simply take the sphere and wrap it in a grid of waterproof tape, much like I've done here and here. That just kind of gives a little extra security. Then I take a candle stake and insert it into the center of the sphere. That gives some stability to my design when I place it atop the Eiffel Tower. Give it a good press so it moves up an inch or so into the sphere, but you want to be sure not to press too hard and break your foam. Then I can begin to add my gypsophilia or baby's breath. I like to do a close level of it. In fact, if I it can use greenery at all, I like to use a little plumosa wrapped around it loosely and then the first level of gyp. But if I'm not to use greens, then I just begin with that closely cropped layer of baby's breath and then I come back with longer layers of it and as you can see that helps to cover the foam and fills it out since it's such a lightweight flower it adds some visual weight to it. Now if I wanted to make this same design of course fully filled out a top a Lomi design system then what I could do is first of all take my Lomi glue and glue the bottom of the column to my dish. You want to do that at least 24 hours in advance. And then I can take my hot melt glue in my glue pan and I can dip a sphere into the melted glue and adhere it to my universal piece. Let that dry and then I can take my waterproof tape and as I described before create a grid around it for some extra strength and be sure the tape comes across and catches the universal piece making it more secure. Then I just simply pop that atop my column after it has dried and create my design. I hope that this is helpful to you and I invite you to visit our website oasisfloralproducts.com. We have lots of free flower tips and techniques and design ideas on our idea page. While you're there, be sure to subscribe to the Idea Weekly blog. I'm Sharon McGookin with Oasis Floral Products and we'll have more tips next time.